Hello, and welcome to the Brocade Training Video Series, presented by IT Management Corp. In today's video, we're going to show you how to view and manage system logs. Master Log window is always available at the bottom part of the BNA window. You can expand it for a wider view. There are always many logged events that show up in that window. Most of them are just informational, notes, or notifications. You can select and acknowledge the events at any time, so you can have them sorted later by these criteria as well. To be able to sort out the logs, you can apply filters from the drop-down menu. By default, there's no filter available. Here, we've already set up some filters to display only warnings, alerts, notices, debugs, DPDU guard-related events, etc. To modify or create a new filter, you need to click on a small gray window next to Filter drop-down menu. It will open a new window where you can define filters. Let's take a look at it. For example, BPDU filter. The way it filters the event is set in the event description. So when we have BPDU there, it will filter only the events with BPDU in the event description string that comes from the switch. This filter is set to monitor all the products, but you can set it to only some specific product or a group of products. Also, you can select which product category and event severity to be displayed with this filter. For the BPDU filter, we want to check all of them. Now, let's take a quick look at other filters like criticals, errors, warnings, alerts. They only filter events based on their severity, so it's easy to sort out those events at the master log window. Okay, now let's see how to check events that occurred on a specific product. We can right-click on the product from the product or group list, or we can right-click on the switch icon at the layer three topology map. It will open a list of options and you need to click on events. That will open a new window that has all the events which occurred on that product. You can set the number of events that are kept in repository or specify a time interval for that. By default, it is 10 million events or for a duration of 365 days. After the limits are reached, the events are moved into files. Thanks for watching. 